words, Ghost Machine, the third episode of Series 1, is written by Helen Raynor and starring John Barrowman, Eve Miles, Ben Gorman, Narako Mori, and Gareth David Lloyd. So yeah, this episode begins with Torture Team chasing after Bernie Harris, a guy in the hood, because he's got a device called Quantum Transducer or Ghost Machine, and it allows humans a form of mental time travel, so... After Bernie Harris drops it and Gwen picks it up and press the button, she sees a young boy in 1941 during a London Blitz. And his name is Tom Flanagan. We find out his mum and his sister died during the war. And because of the paper error, Tom was accidentally left behind the train station on his own overnight. Luckily, he was eventually picked up, but still scary. Then in present time, Gwen meets Tom, and he apparently has an adult daughter called Ellery, who greeted Owen and Gwen and helped Owen to make tea. The old Tom Flanagan is played by John Normington, who previously played Morgus in The Caves of Androzani, and Trevor Sigma in The Happiness Patrol in classic Doctor Who series. So the Torchwood decide to look for Bernie, who's a thief, and even his mum wouldn't let him home until he gives her £50. He owes her. When Bernie stole Quantum Transducer and pressed it, he sees a woman putting her dead baby in the waterway. Holy shit! When Bernie used it again, he witnessed the murder of Lizzie Lewis and tried to blackmail Ed Morgan, a killer, and he refused to give him anything. But when Bernie sees his future, he sees himself dead on the road outside his house, still young, and covered in blood, which is pretty grim. So when he told Gwen about it and she tells Jack about it, it was only one of many possible futures. Bernie went outside after this to confront Morgan, who was threatening to kill him. Scared, Bernie told him he would keep it a secret, and the tortured team disarmed Morgan and saving Bernie's life. I love the scene where Jack teaches Gwen how to shoot. It is well done how they did it. Ed Morgan is the villain in this episode, and man, what a bastard! When Owen sees the night where Ed killed Lizzie, he confronted him and decided to provoke him because Owen wanted to avenge the death of Lizzie. Gwen decided to take the knife from Owen, but then Ed ran into Gwen and stabbed himself with a knife. When Gwen sees it, she thought she killed Owen, but turns out she accidentally killed Ed. Plus, Ed wanted to anyway, so yeah, this episode is really dark and scary. There's great acting here. I'd love to hear what you guys think of this episode. Thanks for watching and see you next time.